Your machinery is a serious investment and at the heart of every farming operation. That's why Machinery Pete has partnered with Big Iron to launch Machinery Pete Auctions, a powerful resource connecting buyers and sellers of used farm equipment. Welcome to Machinery Pete TV Auction Edition. Hey folks, welcome to the Machinery Repeat TV Auction Edition. We are previewing our upcoming July 19th online auction at machinerypeat.com. Tell you what, we've got over 80 items on this month's sale, including some amazing tractors. The very first ever made International 2 Plus 2 6788 tractor. And how about a 1971 4020 with only 3,822 hours? All that and more coming up on the Machinery Repeat TV Auction Edition. All right, folks, a few highlights from our July 19th online auction from our friends at KDK Sales and Equipment out of Washington, Iowa. 14 items, including three round balers, this 2006 New Holland BR780. They've also got a super sharp 2011 New Holland H7450 disc bind, one owner, 13 foot cutting width. And how about this, a Crone Big M mower conditioner. There's 87 pictures plus a video on this thing, folks. Be sure to check it out. If we keep moving east, let's go over to Illinois. Our friends at 217 Ag Solutions have nine items on the sale, including four tractors, a pair of 2002 John Deere. How about this 7510 with 5,525 hours and a loader? This is a one owner tractor out of Illinois. And then also this John Deere 7700 with just 3,520 hours from Huntington, Indiana. And how about a 1942 Ford 8N with a funk flat top inline six conversion from Huntington, Indiana? Seller, here's my good friend, Seth Doctor. Keep going east, we'll head to Ohio. Wilson National has 10 items on the auction. How about this unique 1974 Oliver 2255 front wheel assist showing 3,200 hours with a 3,208 CAD engine, second owner. This thing has spent its whole life in the Wauseon, Ohio area. They're also selling this 1984 International 284. Folks, check this out, only 475 hours, turf tires, Click the bid button on this one, bring this baby home. Next, let's hop out west. Our friends at Barry Machinery have three tractors on the auction. And how about this, a 1969 John Deere 4000. And this thing, uh, the seller is a longtime John Deere mechanic, which is always a nice feature. They're also selling this 1978 International 1486, 6,465 hours on it, one owner. Our good friends at Hot List Equipment have five tractors on the July 19th auction, including a restored Massey Ferguson 165 from Florida. Look at this thing, folks. Completely restored. Just beautiful. The sellers own it for 20 years. They only used it to grade their road. Fantastic condition. And they've got a 1971 John Deere 4320, 8,400 hours with a new canopy from Searcy, Arkansas. Volunteer Machinery out of Thompson Station, Tennessee is selling this 2001 Case H C50 two-wheel drive with 3,300 hours, one owner with a mower. My good friend, Mike Mosky Auction Service from Mount Pulaski, Illinois, is selling this 2010 Kinsey 3660 16-row planter. This thing's had almost 15K spent on it pre-planting this year. And this Krauss 8005 Accelerator, three years old, under 4,000 acres on it, always shedded. From j &L Agri Service out of Indiana, a Ford 9600, 4,083 hours, always shedded. And how about an Alice Chelmer 72 combine, all original, always stored inside, and this McCormick Deering Hart Jr. threshing machine, always stored inside. Stick around, folks. Coming up, we're going to check out a 1971 John Deere 4020 diesel from Indiana. It's on our July 19th auction with 3,822 original hours on it. Hey folks, pleased to be joined by my friend Brent McKillop with McKillop Machinery out of Wabash, Indiana. And Brent, I tell you, you've got quite a tractor on our July 19th Machine Repeat Online auction here. Why don't you tell us about it? Yeah, it's a pretty rare find. It's a 1971 4020 diesel, uh, synchro, full vision cab, duals, nice original two owner tractor. Sold new in the county just south of us. Um, had never been out of that county. Wow. Farmer, 250 acre farmer. Uh, yeah, did just you a say quality tractor? 
It's only 3,822 hour, original hours on a brand. That is correct. And it, I've drove it a, a bunch and, uh, and it, it, it's, I've been around it a lot and it had it sitting right outside my office in the shop for quite some time. And it, it, it drives like a new one. Wow. And this was uh, from a farmer, local farmer that you had dealt with before on some other equipment? Yeah, yeah. We had purchased some other equipment from, from him and then um, you know, about a year ago. And then this winter ended up getting the opportunity to buy the 4020 off of his family. Well, you've been in the business a long time, Brent. You know these 4020s, especially these 71s and 2s. Man, they, they're in such demand, these diesels. And uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sure you've seen that uh, over the years, the increasing demand for these things in condition like this in particular. Yeah, they're, they've increased quite a bit and, and, and just hard to find in this condition. Uh, just very, very, I'm just glad to have the opportunity to own it. <laughs> yeah. Well, again, thanks for putting it on our auction. And folks, again, sales absolute. So hop on to machinerypeat.com, click that bid button. And very, very rare opportunity here for a, a tractor that's never been more than 10 miles from its, its home there. What was the dealership it sold at originally, Brent? And uh, was it Swayze, Indiana? Yeah, Swayze, Indiana was Harper and Payne at that time and then went to Harper Implement and then is now part of TTG. Okay, right, TTG, gotcha. And uh, yeah, you know, I, Brent, I saw a 71 4020, I think it was kind of out around Bluffton, Indiana, about Thanksgiving time last year that brought uh, similar hours, and I think it was like 36, 36, 5. So good condition uh, and the demand on these things. I think, and I think the average auction price last year was the highest I've ever seen it on a 4020. So uh, market's very strong now. I do want to touch a little bit, Brent. You guys have had some tremendous growth there with McKillop Machinery out of Wabash, Indiana. First of all, congratulations to you and your wife, Keisha. Um, Thank you. But uh, yeah, tell us a little bit about the business. We started the business um, just uh, four years ago. We just turned four years, um, June 6th, and uh, saw an opportunity in the area for a used equipment dealer and good quality used. and. Uh, it's it's really skyrocketed. It's grown way faster than I ever thought it would. Um, we became a Vermeer dealer, a Bush Hog dealer, and sell new easy load seat tenders. And but our main focus is used. Um, we have an auction ourselves. We started last December, right? Um, and we're gonna have that three times a year. And uh, what months so, do you have your auction, Brent? So we uh, third Friday in March, third Friday in August, and third Friday in December. Okay. Uh, 9 a.m. on-site and online. Um, yeah, the first two have been very well accepted. We take consignments. Um, I saw a need for um, some guys to get in the area to get rid of their excess equipment. Right. And it, it's really been welcomed very well. Well, we're excited to have you guys. McKillop Machinery is one of our certified auction partners for our Machine Repeat monthly online auction, Brent. And uh, please pass along to your wife, Keisha, that, uh, that I'm a huge fan of, of what she does on Instagram and YouTube under the Machinery Girl uh, moniker. And folks, take it from me. You got to follow Keisha. Uh, loves machinery. She'll highlight the great equipment McKillop Machinery has. Just go to YouTube and type in Machinery Girl. You'll find YouTube channel. I think Instagram too. Is that right, Brent? That's correct. Yep. She's taken yeah. uh, my dream and taken a little spin off to it and uh, made it her, you know, something that she can enjoy and uh it i it's it's neat to see how far that's come also it's, it's yeah cool. well folks definitely check out this 1971 john Deere 4020 that brent and keisha with mckillop machinery have on our july 19th machine repeat auction only 3822 original second owner hours it's a beautiful rig brent thank you for telling us about it hey thank you Stay with us, folks. Coming up, we're going to check out 21 sets of ag tires and wheels on our July 19th Machine Repeat online auction. What's that piece of equipment worth? Check out Machine Repeat's auction prices for the answer. Free to view, updated daily, all types of equipment. Go to machinerypeat.com and click on the auction tab, then auction price data. 
Hey folks, pleased to be joined again by Eric McPherson, owner founder of Dawson Tire and Wheel out of Gothenburg, Nebraska. Eric, welcome back to the show. Yeah, thanks, Greg. I'm looking forward to auction number two. Yeah, well, hey, we were really excited back in June to kick off our monthly uh, Ag Tire and Wheel online auction as part of our monthly machine repeat event. And of course, partnering with you, Dawson Tire and Wheel, your guys' history going back almost a quarter century there, Eric. Uh, selling all types of tires. Uh, really appreciate your experience. And man, we've got 21 sets of tires on our July 19th Machine Repeat Online Auction. Quite a variety on this month's sale. Yeah, Greg, and we're, we just want to continue to stress that appreciate the bidder activity last time and the, the opportunity to buy with confidence. We, we're going to take care of people, want to make sure that they can bid with absolute confidence that they're buying the, the best that's out there. Yeah, and again, uh, our whole goal here, Eric, is to kind of take and lift up the space, the egg tire and wheels, uh, kind of from the from the shadows of the auction market and then give it the prominence and uh, trusted uh, buying, selling confidence that it deserves and needs. So on this month, again, of your 21 sets of tires, we actually have, uh, I think, five uh, new sets of tires. I think that's right, um, Greg, and, you know, really wanted to come into this season knowing harvest is just around the corner. It doesn't seem like it, but combines will be rolling pretty soon won't they and wanted to pull forward some combine duels wanted yeah. to pull forward some combine just some spare tires if right you know you're running two or three machines and just need a spare sitting there just right. really give the really give the producer the opportunity to have what they need when they need it right now on the on the on the topic of combine tires on the july 19th auction eric uh can you give us a couple examples of, of what's up for sale yep i know we Put together a set of high tread 52042s um, for the for John Deere combine, the S S six seventies, the S six series combines. Um, we'll work on a lot more than that, and then we've also got a set of 48042s for the twenty volt case. Uh, fit yeah. everything from like a twenty three eighty eight on. So yeah. just again, guys needing something, want to want to switch over to a set of duals. I think. We're going to start focusing on some, you know, big single flotation tires down the road too for that. So, right. Well, again, on the, you know, the used tires on the auction, again, I just love Eric, how you guys have worked in the tread sure rating, which again, folks, uh, Dawson tire and wheel has a, a wonderful app called tread sure go out, uh, onto your Apple store or wherever and download that app, but you've built a database of every tire model with the tread depth. And then you guys bring, uh, your industry eyes to this. So I noticed on a, you know, a set of Firestone, four sets of tires, you had treacher rating of 97%, other tires, 72%, 52%, 49. So again, uh, industry eyes and expertise, again, all plays into that, what you said before, Eric, buy with confidence. Right. And so that means if it's 72%, that's what it is. It's not, I stuck my finger in it and, you know, right. I, I think it's about, <laughs> Right. right. We're, we are using data. I think it's good to point that up. Right. Well, I'm a data guy, you know, 32 years compiling auction prices. You have a, a data heart there too. Uh, again, I love the passion you guys bring to it. And I tell you, Eric, also it's super fun. Folks, check these out. These 21 listings, these uh, egg tires and wheels for sale on our July 19th auction. Uh, Eric's son, Nathan, actually has made a video on each of these sets of tires for sale. And I know in the listing themselves, which you guys very detailed, Eric, and again, thank you for doing that. But quite often you'll mention, you know, whether it's a tractor model series or a combine, you know, what they'll fit. So I love that level of expertise and detail you're providing. Yeah, I think it's, I, I, we hope it's helpful to the to the producer, the, the, the folks out there bidding. Um, I know we've got a set of Kubota, you know, small tires, compact, tractor right. but again then they go to the work of saying these are the these are the tractors or examples of tractors that they'll fit so hopefully that brings the confidence you know if you're bidding on it that if you've got one of those machines it's going to work and, and we're going to stand behind that right well again folks uh at noon central on july 19th in the middle of our machine repeat monthly online auction we're lifting up uh, this new monthly collaboration, the Machine Repeat, Dawson Tire and Wheel, uh, Egg Tire and Wheel online auction, absolute. And again, uh, Eric, thank you for telling us about the 21 sets of tires. Go on online, check them out, folks. Click that bid button. These are, these are, I mean, 
great tires, uh, industry expert verified, and uh, they're ready to put to use. Yeah, that's good. Thank you, Greg. And if you don't find what you're looking for this month, we're going to be back next month and the month after. You bet. Hey, stay tuned, folks. Coming up are feature items on the July 19th auction. Six beautiful red tractors from Gary Perkins in Green City, Missouri. The very first ever made International 6788. Got equipment to sell? Sell it on the Machine Repeat monthly online auction. Call 844-727-6374 and we'll connect you with one of our auction partners to get your equipment listed. Well folks, time for our feature items on our July 19th Machine Repeat monthly online auction. And you maybe noticed I said items there uh, because we have six tractors from Gary Perkins in Green City, Missouri. And I tell you what, these are beautiful red tractors, folks. Uh, we have five two plus twos, kind of rare production models, and a 1955 Farmall 300. Uh, I've been talking to Gary about these tractors for a while. You maybe actually saw them in the recent 4th of July parade in Green City, Missouri. I think Gary and his family and friends have had them running for years there in the parade, kind of an annual hit. But I tell you what, these tractors are just beautiful. And again, some rare production models. And Gary was kind enough to uh, tell us a little bit about his tractors. Okay, this is a 6788, the first one ever built. Uh, I bought it from the original family that bought it new. Uh, it's original except for, I want a little touch up here and there, but that paint is original. This one here is a 1981, 6388. I've had it for, I don't know, five, six years probably. Uh, it's uh, obviously been repainted, but other than that, it's it's original. Uh, it runs, runs great, everything, is, everything works good. It's a 1955, uh, 300, one all. Uh, we just use it on an elevator thing. So folks, I tell you that 6788, the first one ever made, how cool is that? 1981 model. I actually saw this very tractor sell at auction. It was back on uh, March 19th, 2016 in Topeka, Kansas, sold for a record price of $35,000. But again, that was March of 16. The used farm equipment market was much, much softer back then, of course. The, the buyer demand and interest in these rare production model and vintage four wheel drive two plus two tractors has just skyrocketed. Now that 6588 of Gary's, man, that thing's a beauty there uh, with just over uh, 6,300 hours on it. And I've only ever seen 29 6588 sold at auction, the highest being 27,500 bucks. And that was back all the way on December 15th of 2014 in Millstone, New Jersey, a very nice 6588. Now, Gary has two 6388s, and I tell you, that is pretty rare there because I've only seen six 6388s sold at auction in the last 22 and a half years. And if you watch our, our uh, Machinery Repeat TV show on RFD, you maybe remember one that we, uh, we had from Indiana. I think it was Wilkinson, Indiana back in uh, uh, it was uh, January of 2016, sold for 30,000 bucks. That was the record price then sold by Sullivan Auctioneers, but we actually saw one for 32,000 in 2017. So it'll be interesting to see how Gary's uh, sell on the July 19th sale. And again, rare opportunity folks, get online and click that bid button. And the 3788, again, a pretty rare tractor there uh, that Gary has. And that one has 3,208 hours on it. So pretty unique opportunity. The highest I've ever seen at auction is 28,000 bucks. That was back in August of 2017 on an Oxford, Kansas sale. And uh, we do want to thank our certified, our Machine Repeat certified auction partners, Brock Auctions out of uh, Lamar's, Iowa for uh, working with us to get these tractors listed. And again, they sell absolute on July 19th. So go to machinerypeat.com, folks, click that bid button, get yourself a very rare and beautiful 2 Plus 2 International. 
Well, folks, thanks for joining us on the Machine Repeat TV Auction Edition, previewing our July 19th online auction, machinerepeat.com. Hop online, check it out. And hey, if you've got something for sale on our August or September upcoming sales, give us a call, 844-727-6374. of equipment is on machinerypeat.com. Search equipment from dealerships across the country to find what you're looking for. Only on machinerypeat.com.